Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. This one, we're in AIEs and I got something awesome to show you. This is one of the best and probably my favorite AI image headshot generator or headshot generator. And the reason why is two things. One, quality. Two, it's completely free. At least right now, that might change in the future. I don't know, it's not up to me, but this, I created this free. Now, this looks pretty good, I'll be honest with you. Let's click on this image here. Good looking image, I'll zoom in a bit here. Okay, but here's the thing. Check out the original image that I used to generate this. This uses image to image, and if I open this up here, look at the facial structure of this lady here. It's a bit zoomed in, I'll zoom in a bit more. And then look at the image on the left here. It's the same face, practically, the same face, but this time in a little bit more of a Halloween-y style. So that's it in a nutshell, what I'm gonna show you. Keep in mind that they now have 60 new styles as well. So not only can you do what I just showed you there, you can do it in 60 different styles. So if you're looking at creating uh, consistent characters, this is an app you will wanna check out, especially given the price tag. So anyways, let's dig in. I'll show you how to sign up and get going. All right, the first step is an easy one. Just head over to AIEs.ai. I will put a link in the description below. And then up here at the top, you'll see graphics and under graphics, you get a whole bunch of different options. Passport, photo maker, image enlargement, photo enhancer, background remover, photo restoration, etc. AI image generator. Also a good one, but what we're looking for in this one is a headshot generator. Click on that one here and then bam, here we go. They've got 60 new styles that you can use. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get free AI headshots. I'll just click on that and we're in business. You'll notice here that I am logged in, but again, I have a free account. So everything you see me doing here does not cost me money, at least as of August 15th, 2024. <laughs> so here we go, let's take a quick look around here. Here are all the different styles. You'll see these are the main eight styles. We've got a cyberpunky style here, and then we've got some Stranger Things type look going on there, I guess. Uh, art, uh, what is that, Nouveau? Art Nouveau or Deco, I can't remember the heck the name of it is, but they've got all sorts of different styles. But I mean, if you really wanna look a little deeper here, down at the bottom, you'll see that it's all basically put into genres, professional, old money, anime, etc. Also, you can go ahead and filter by gender. So if I was gonna do a female one, for example, why not? Let's go with the female style. Look at this here. Now you can get in and you'll see that there's all these different styles. The reason why I'm showing you this is because a lot of people use headshot generators just for professional content. So your LinkedIn profile picture, but you can do a whole lot more and consistent character generation is something you may want to consider using this for, especially again, given the price tag. So let's go ahead and create, I don't know, you know what? I want to have a little bit of fun. So this one here kind of has some cyberpunky look to it. So I'm going to try it. Nice and easy here. Now, we can go ahead and use the photo that I already used. Now, I'm gonna click the X there. So this is basically what you'd be seeing right out of the box. And then you'll see here, for a portrait, you can see here that they prefer frontal portraits. Those ones work best. So I'm gonna go into my finder, and then I'm gonna go into AI, uh, what the heck did I call it? I called it AIEs. There it is, I'll put it in my little folder structure, why not? There we go. And here we go, we've got a whole bunch of images. In this one, we're working with a female, so I'm gonna grab this one here, and I'm gonna drag and drop this in just like that. And then presto, I just go ahead and drop it in. It's going to go ahead and give me some options here. Now you can see a couple things. This A is not a very good headshot. Uh, first off, it's got the phone in it, and it just doesn't look quite right. And secondly, for those of you that have been following Flux AI, this is made using Flux AI. So this is actually not even a real person. So we're gonna take a non-real person, make it into a headshot, and again, of a non-real person. So it's AI image to AI image, pretty cool, crazy times. Anyways, there we go. We can select our aspect ratio. Most cases you want one to one, but if you want to make this into something that you would use on a YouTube thumbnail, for example, you can go ahead and make it 16.9. I'm just gonna leave it as is. Click on generate. It's gonna take a few seconds to cook. When it's done, I'm gonna come back, show you what we got. All right, welcome back. So here's what we got. And I'm gonna be honest with you, they are fantastic. Here, I'm gonna show you the original image just so we can keep an eye on that. So if we just look at this real carefully here, look at the image on the left, look at the face on the left, Look at the face on the right, that is amazing. It even kept the same teeth type structure. Two front teeth right there, about the same size, kind of like the same mouth structure. Pretty wild stuff, added in some cyberpunk art flair. Now you will notice one thing here, if you wanna download them, you can just go ahead and download, click on one of them like this here, and just download it. It does ask you though, if you want to remove the watermark. I guess they're 
testing this out here. When I click on remove watermark, this still means that the app or the platform is free, but they ask you to share it to either Facebook or Twitter, X Twitter or x.com or even into Discord, into one of your Discord chats, just so you can share that, you know, this program is out there and get the word out there. So I think that's a fair trade for this level of quality and the fact that it is completely free. So there you go, guys. This is how you use AIE's AI Headshot Generator. This creates high-end stuff, guys. It's worth a look. Links in the description below. Thanks for watching.